hello hello guys welcome back to this tutorial this is my first tutorial of assembly design in Katea V5 this is what we will do uh, it is an assembly of piston and cylinder as you can see here uh, I have already assembled it but we will do it again so let's start to start off go to start and click on mechanical design assembly design okay let's do it again start mechanical design assembly design good now this is the assembly workbench here there are different features to start click on this existing component with positioning click and uh, double click on product this so uh, I am going to where I put my files here I have cylinder and uh, piston so select all the files as you uh, as you want uh, I select now piston and cylinder open this is the part click OK now it seems like an assembly but it's not assembled so click on uh, this this is manipulation click here you can drag any part according to those axes it may be in the axis drag along x-axis maybe along y axis it's maybe along the axis as you want drag along any axis so to exclude the two parts let's select this and uh, okay this may not be good let's select this z axis okay y axis nice it's very good now so we have to assemble those two parts as we want this uh, port is the outlet port and uh, this is the inlet port I think you have watched my previous tutorial uh, about this uh, parts so let's start this is coincident constraints that means as you can see here it's very good for assembling you know circular pads which have you know centers and this is contact constraint that means to uh, assemble two or more parts which has a flat surface and this is the offset constraint this is angle constraint as you can see here you can assemble two parts which have angle this is the fixed component so to start uh, for this case let's select this coincide okay close it select the center of this uh, cylinder click and again the center of this uh, the piston good now let's click update all or you can use control plus u click on this it's assembled but it may not be at the exact place or the exact position as we want so this is the head of the piston we have to move inside of the cylinder uh, it may be uh, 30 millimeter from this outer surface so offset constraint click close it between this surface and this surface 
nice this is the direction how we can offset this part so uh, let's make it this one minus 70.152 let's make it 30 30 update it now it is inside the piston uh, sorry the cylinder the cylinder which is far from uh, this surface by 30 millimeter that means as you know before uh, the cylinder has 20 millimeter uh, thickness this means there is a gap between you know the inside surface of this cylinder and uh, the surface of the piston head so it seems like this when we assemble piston and cylinder good now let's hide this constraints click on this and hide nice this is what I wanna do thank you very much I am Asma Masafa please subscribe my channel below and uh, click the sign of the bell and uh, when I release different videos a notification will be come to you so please subscribe my channel thank you very much